a good way of putting it, like what they, they just did the dark side of the ring this past this week was about Matt Bourne. And he did. He made it look so he laid it in. I mean, he was and I I, I my I, I recorded my podcast with Corey Castle last night. I have a Matt Bourne story. And if anybody wants to hear the whole thing, I met him in ninety five when he was still doing Doink at an independent show. It was in Cuyahoga Falls, Ohio. And a lot of the guys were afraid to approach him and talk to him, I guess. <laughs> because <laughs> they, they thought he was crazy. He's out in the parking lot. He's, he's, he's dressed up like doink. He's out in the parking lot, smoking a cigarette. And he's basically just kind of sitting on the back of a back car bumper and leaning against the glove, uh, the trunk. And he's just smoking a cigarette. I just walked up to him and said, Hey, how you doing? Nice to meet you. I'm Lou. He's like, oh, Matt. And we just, we talked for maybe about 10 minutes. And I, the first thing I brought up to him was I said, you know what? I got to tell you, man, I always like watching you work, especially your match with steamboat at the first WrestleMania. And he kind of looked surprised at me, like, you remember that? <laughs> you know, he, he, in other words, I, he, I guess he, I let him know that I was actually a student of the business and I got it. And I said, Hey, I've been working for about two years. You know, you know, I want to pick your brain if you don't mind. He said, Sure. He appreciated me doing that. And he's like, You know, that's how you learn is by talking to these guys and listening to them. And he was kind of telling me, you know, make it look like a shoot. Make it look like a shoot. Yeah. If you don't, you know, in other words, if you're not, if you don't believe in what you're selling, they're not going to buy it. And I was like, okay, thanks. And he shook my hand. He goes, you're going to make it, kid. 